hey everyone welcome back to another video and in this video i would like to talk about how to fix an error code that is lost connection error in the game when you're trying to play the roblox and you get an error code 277 and how you can fix this up so let me directly get into the step so the first one is all about what we need to do is we need to make a few changes in the dns on our system so just go over here search for the control panel you have to click over here in the control panel navigate to network and internet now from here what we need to do is we just need to click on change adapter settings that over here if you can click on the first you have to click on the network and sharing center now from here you need to click on change adapter settings now from here you can see we have two options and this is the connected wi-fi which is called the shadow so what i need to do is right click on this and go to the properties now from here I have what I need to do is just go over here. What I need to do is I just need to scroll down and you have to click on Internet Protocol version 4. You have to click on this particular one, double click on this one and you have to go over here and we need to give a value over here for the preferred DNS server and under alternate DNS server. So the preferred DNS server I have to give the value 8, 8, 8 and for the alternate DNS server I have to give the value 8, 8 four and four that's what i have to give i have to give this particular value go for okay and once afterwards you have to check with the roblox if the issue is there or not still if the issue is not fixed out what we need to do is we just need to go over here and we need to search for speed test on a system because for running these kind of games like the roblox we need at least four mb per second on the upload as well as on the download so just go over here go and you have to check whether you are having enough speed if you don't have enough speed or if you've gone through any kind of issue with your Wi-Fi, definitely you will not be able to fix this app. So what we need to do is you just need to cross check this. You have to cross check the download and you have to cross check the upload as well. You have to check both and once afterwards, still if there is an issue, we need to move to the next one. Next one is all about what we need to do. Just go over here. We have to go to add our program. Over here, you need to go over here. We need to uninstall the Roblox and that's what we have to do. So just go over here in the program over here and we need to check for the Roblox over here you have to check for the Roblox and you can see you'll be having this particular one called Roblox player for the admin just click over here in this one and uninstall it once afterwards we just need to go back over here and afterwards you have to download the Roblox once again and you have to reinstall it back most probably when you go to the Google search you can search for the download Roblox and you can get into this particular page from where you can download this one even after trying with the state, if there is an issue, we need to move to the next one, which is all about we need to cross check the server status of the Roblox. So right now we're on the server status of the Roblox. You can see it is all up and running, so we don't have an issue with this. So these are the possible workaround and I hope this quick video is helpful. And afterwards you can try opening the Roblox and most probably you'll not be having any kind of issue regarding the error code 277. You don't have any issue with the Roblox now. Right now I can play the Roblox from here. That's what you have to do. So I hope this quick video is helpful and if you find this video helpful, don't forget to subscribe and click on the bell icon for more of these kind of videos. See you soon in the next video. Bye bye.